it came a time when we moved by ourselves. I guess Mauli, where we live in right now, that was the first time, you know? Mm-hmm. We moved by yeah, state by we state. Had, we get, both from your parents, uh, we bought that place where we live right now. It's not the same house, because we built that house. It was a, it was an old, an older house was there, and it was built different, you know. And uh, I don't know how come I just tear it down and decide to build this new one. And so we got after it pretty quick. We bought it. You like to be working like a carpenter. Building, oh, yeah. Building. Yeah, that's like what that. I did all my life. But we didn't, we didn't last. How long will it stay away? Four years. Huh? We'll, four years? We live in the old house four years. Four we, years. We tear it down and make the house that we're living now. Well, where is it at? Uh, it's the place? same place. Uh-huh. Same place? At the same place. Where the house, house was set on the same place. It was just like a, a ranch house, you know, like like if you go somewhere so you see old houses. And then one day I'd Get up and decide to tear it down, just tear it down. And then I don't even know whom we built that other one. The one we live in. But I, I built that one too, so. We got married on March the 3rd, 1962. Well, to be there was a beautiful wedding. We have like a reception at, the, at those years. And we had a dance, so it was beautiful. We've been married for 58 years, and uh, to be, we've been very happy. We have five, five sons, and they have 13 grandchildren, so. That's too many years. <laughs> he always said that, that too many years. <laughs> We met in a platform dancing, you know, a dancing place. In a small town named Charco, Texas. And she was over there with her folks, Mama, Mama, you dead? Mama, so you well, and she, somebody. Yeah, she, she somebody was my aunt. She was the one that raised me. Well, he went, he saw me, he went to go, he went and asked me to dance with him. That was a long, long, long time ago. Your kids in order is who came first? Okay, it was Raleigh, and then Ray, and Robert, Ella, Ricky, and then we have a little, another baby, baby Rudy, but he died, and then uh, David. 
what is what is one of your like favorite times together or memories that you had? Our times together. Well, when we your when my kids were growing up, and we used to go like to Six Flags and mm-hmm. take them to you know places like that. Mm-hmm. Help us everything is everything you know. I mean, all these years. I mean, we used to go a lot to Fort Worth to the carnivals to. It was. It's a big, big place over there. People just go. We used to go. Every time we went over there, we went to that place. Was it crazy growing up, like what, with all the boys running around? Or was it like? To be like fun. <laughs> I was happy. Yeah. What was, what was like Christmas like? Well, at that time, we didn't have we didn't have too much to give them a lot of Christmas, but we give them something every year. Like one time, yeah, they were already grown, land, but still they were small. And Chelo bought a bicycles, like a big bicycle for relay, and those is for, for the kids, a small bicycles. So. They, they were, I mean, every year we had a little money too. And then 13 grandchildren? And 13 grandchildren. That's too many to name, right? Well, it, it's Michael. At the, at the end is Ray. I mean, they're from Ray. It's Alisa and Andrew. And then Roberts. It's a. Uh, like Jeffrey and Chris and Gracie and Trey and Robbie, somebody else, and Dusty, <laughs> and Dusty. <laughs> I knew that I was missing one. Okay, and the end, okay, that was Robert. Okay, Robert. Ricky, yeah. did you and Caleb? And David, well, Chaley and Clay. But no great grandchildren yet, right? No, I'm waiting for great grandchildren. Nobody wants. Oh, well, you know, when I have my grandchildren, my sisters, everybody was a grandfather already, and I didn't have not even one, one grandbaby. <clears throat> and I said, gosh, I'm going to get, I'm getting old and no grandbabies. But all of a sudden, here comes all the grandbabies at one time. So I guess the baby, that's going to happen to me. One of these days, well, but I'm not complaining. It's up to, it's up to you all, my grandchildren. <laughs> and lastly, what's it like to see all your kids and grandkids grow up? Well, we, we miss them, but uh, that's right. We'll, we'll, like, uh, I'm happy for you, for all my kids to get married. And I'm happy, like, we all were going to get married, too. So that's something that, that is natural, you know, I mean, I'm, When are you going to get married? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Pretty soon? Well, we've been married, like I said, for 50, 58 years, and, and I've been happy, you know, and I've also been happy too, you know. With you know how old I am? You don't know? 94? Huh? 93? 93? 91. 91? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 